What's up YouTube, I'm Mr. No Name, or Max as people know me in the real world, and today I'm bringing you the second half of that Blitz gameplay I promised. Um, I'm sorry I couldn't get a video out yesterday guys, I had some technical issues with the computer, and on top of that, some extra homework, you know, right before break. The teachers love to flood us, but it's all good, they gotta do what they gotta do. Um, so this video is actually rather important, it's a very large team update. So some of you may have noticed that I am no longer a part of Mercy and the reason for this is because Mercy has merged with Team Flight which is an international organization that just started up I believe the beginning of this week or a little bit before that um, I don't know exactly how long he has been getting things together before he started the Twitter and everything and the teams going but you know he, he's been getting the ball rolling on that and I'll talk about that in just a minute but so what's happening to Mercy um Plizix and Quaddy, or Alex and Levi, if you know their real names, well, now you know their real names, but anyway, they are still in management of Mercy, however, right now it doesn't have a competitive team, it, it's just the public match and sniping division, so they are both on the competitive roster now for Team Flight US division, however, they're also in management of Team Mercy, if that makes sense. So, why did we join Flight? Because like I said, it's a fairly new organization here, and honestly, Mercy has been established longer, but the, the reasons we did is I feel like we are going to have more success under Team Flight than under Team Mercy, and the reason for this is because, like I said, how fast the leader, who is uh, David, how, how fast he has been getting this all together and just how professional it seems to be. You know, at first I was like, I, I don't know if this is really going to be right for us or anything, but it, it's working out really well. You know, he was really professional and organized when he contacted us. Their Twitter looks nice. They, you know, okay, they've already got a U.S. team, editors, web designer, snipers, the leader of the European team who is picking out his roster now, and the jerseys um, designed. They're not made yet, but they are designed. And all of this, as far as I know, has happened within this week, like this past week which is an insane amount of work and on top of that he's working on getting a sponsorship deals as well which I'll discuss more in a minute and it, it's absolutely crazy what's going on I mean and you know he he knows how to do it he's like alright we're gonna work on building a por portfolio you know we gotta start doing some tournaments and you know get the placings out and he's gonna keep track of stuff for us and everything I just feel like it's going to be a really good opportunity for us and we're gonna be trying really hard to make this thing work and right there I just absolutely annihilated that kid but anyway, into the sponsorship thing, and before I go any further, at the end of this video, if you're still here, so the people at the beginning didn't get to hear this if they clicked off, so ha 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 for them, there's actually going to be a giveaway that I'll be talking about at the end of this video, so stay tuned for that. But anyway, the sponsorship, we are actually on a, what I would call a trial period sponsorship, and basically, there's a new controller company, fairly new, called Shark U Controllers, and they are putting us on a trial period for a month to see how many you know sales we can get them and you might be like okay well that means you're gonna be very biased towards them yes that is true I'm not gonna lie to you guys I will be biased towards them however from what I've seen they look like really awesome controllers and I'll be doing a video specifically on them but all of their information is in the description below if you wanna go check them out ahead of time but within the next few days I'll be doing a video going to their website showing you everything about it so I'm not going to lie to you guys about it, okay? I mean, I will be biased. It is a biased opinion, but I will be giving you facts. I'm not going to lie and be like, oh, this controller is going to instantly making you like a god player and you're going to be better than Scumpy or something. I'm not going to lie to you, okay? But anyway, so we have a 5% off promo code, and that code is FLIGHT. And all you got to do is when you order, there's a special note box, and you just put the word the promo code flight in there and that it'll give you five percent off the order and what that does for us is it lets them keep track of the sales that we generate for them and so if we generate enough then that sponsorship could become permanent and what this will do for us is it will allow us to be doing giveaways on our channel it'll allow us to possibly start traveling to events if they give us you know the full sponsorship and everything because they're going to start giving us some money to do some more things and like I said, for the U.S. team of flight right now, we do not have money to travel to events. We, we don't have the money. We need sponsorship to do that. So that's why we need you guys to use the promo code if you decide to order. So please use that if you do. And so into the very last thing, and that is the giveaway. So 
Sharku Controllers are actually doing a giveaway on their channel right now, and I will link that in the description below to that exact video that you can go to. And all you got to do is you have to subscribe to them on their YouTube channel, you have to be following them on Twitter, and then retweet their tweet about the giveaway. And then you will be entered for that drawing. So that'll be good so as you guys can see we're coming to the end of this video if you enjoyed it then please like comment and or subscribe if you didn't then let me know what i can do better in the comment section below constructive criticism goes a long way guys until next time everybody peace out